So yeah, good morning, good morning, good morning. We're up. It is Saturday. We got some beautiful light going on right now. But we have the most important thing that you need to do to live a cleanse life. You need to clean. You know, I struggle with it, but I do it. Okay? So sunshine. Use energy. Get your chores done. Let's get it. So I finally got those chores all done, cleaned up everything, reorganized. I got my buddy back behind me. Let's turn that around. He's waiting on me because I have to cut my hair. And I'm excited for today because it's the weekend. Where I coach at normally is on lockdown because COVID scares. So I have two days off and I did get to my goal of above 30 miles and I'm gonna go run after I cut my hair. And we're gonna try to get to 35 plus miles this week, which is a, 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 a good goal for me because I don't know, I have a mental barrier when it gets over 30 miles and I don't know, I just get tired and stuff. So I'm having my coffee finally. I gotta shape this hair up. I need to get it rebraided probably next week. But, you know, what can you do? English, bro. They talk about, um, but no. So we got a little edit going on. Progress, slow progression. Not too fast. So we're shaped up. We're gonna get dressed and we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna hit maybe three to four miles. Like I said, I'm over 30. I'm at my goal. But why not push it to see how far you can go? Cause you never know when you're gonna train. This stuff is different. Like training like this is different. It's hard on your body. You don't know when your last run is gonna be. And you gotta be thankful you have the opportunity, so push it. Alrighty, let's go. So it's actually the warmest it's been in a while. It's about um, 51 degrees right now. And it's in between that weather where you have to wear a whole lot and a little bit. So I'm kind of confused, but I'm gonna roll with I have a long sleeve, I have a t-shirt on, and I have my running pants, and I have compression shorts under. I have small socks, and I have my running shoes, so I'm gonna roll with that. And I have my shades on, because it's very sunny out here today. And we're gonna roll with that, okay? So, we're gonna try to do like three or four miles, nothing too crazy, because I'm already over 30, and it's a cheat day. So, I think I'm gonna go to Popeyes and get some chicken today, Saturday, you know. Be blessed, man. All right, let's go, knock it out. It's a beautiful day out here, and I'm coming up on mile three, 35 for the week. The workout is 60 minutes, and we put that effort in. And now every mile extra is for brownie points. The goal was 35, we got there. I'm excited for cheat day. Some good food in me.
you just gotta get them carbs in. I didn't have a chance to get it right after my run, but I'm eating a banana right now. Like I said, it's kind of like a lifestyle. You're always kind of preparing, but you're really not too focused in it too much. You know what I mean? Like you gotta have a balance of having a life and also your training and your exercising because that's just one portion of you. That's not who you actually are. So oh, you remember that it's not your life because at any moment you could not be able to train anymore. And what else are you gonna have, you know? So it's more of a, you gotta have a good spirit because spirit of faith is always, is forever. No matter what you are, when you're dead or alive, period. All right, let's go get this food. Bro, you don't understand, I can taste this stuff in my gut, man. Let's just make it there, bro. How this, how this year's been going, you never know what can go down or what is going to happen next. I mean, but we can't worry about it. But it's like you just can't be too sure of anything now. I hope that everybody's realizing that. And I hope maybe it humbled you a little bit because it sure did humble me. Because, you know, people want me to humble myself to them, but they're a mere mortal like you and I. That's why I only humble myself to God and to spirit that's the only man or person you humble yourself to is your spirit point blank period um could i do spicy and um um could i do red beans and rice and then could i do an order of french fries all right and put your drink uh no drink That's when you know you're ready. You plan to not eat inside. You plan to eat in the car in the parking lot. That's when you know you are ready for something. You don't even care. You just want it, and you want it then. I need to drink. That's what I'm food. I'm gonna eat one bite of this, and I'm about to cut out because I deserve this. Oh my god, that looks so good. Sauce first, while I bite this. I'm gonna cut on this part. I gotta show y'all. You know, you need something to drink. Hope this stuff. You need biscuits. Alrighty. Spicy. Alrighty. God bless. experience because you have to let go of all your ego you're strong enough you're big enough your body's fine enough because this running thing isn't about how you look it's about accomplishing goals and you're not looking the strongest I'll tell you that you're not feeling the strongest but you are proving something to yourself so our fitness goals are for ourselves and nobody else like I said, this is a humbling experience and I love doing this. Like, I really had to find passion in exercising and this is keeping me sane. Like, it really is keeping me sane out of all this craziness in the world. It's keeping my mind straight, you know? It's giving me something that I can't just accomplish and get bored of. Like, I, I feel hungry to just, to go more. I to, I'm, tomorrow's my off day and, you know, I, I, when I run now, I don't get tired running. It's more my body starts hurting. So you have to taper it down and just kind of like buckle it down because you don't want to hurt yourself. So there's a balance with this, which is good, you know? But yeah, my hamstring, my Achilles are killing me. My body's extra tight and it just needs a break, man. Need a day off. So I'm looking forward to this all day tomorrow. Editing videos and posting them all by like next weekend, all this week. So 